Good afternoon, everyone. For those of you who don't know, my name is Maya Karen. I run a fashion blog called Classically Kept. It does feature luxury, contemporary, and how-to style. So if you are into that, go ahead and hit the subscribe button to this channel and the notification bell. That way, you will never miss a video. So today's video is just going to be a quick haul for you guys. I got a few things from Express and then I got a few things from Aritzia. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so let's start with Express. This is a dress, and as you can see, it is a turtleneck. Y'all know I love turtlenecks, keeps me warm. But what I love about this is that if you look, it's actually, let me turn this down. They have actually folded it over and then on the sides right here, they have sewn it in so that way you don't see the little frayed edges. I love that little classic detail. So let me go ahead and back up to show y'all the dress. it is a little big I did get a small but there is room for me to grow and it's the sleeves I love the sleeves but for right now we can just add a belt to kind of cinch in the waist I probably wouldn't use this belt but we can use this one because it's a little bit big in in right here in the waist but other than that I really love it and it comes right to the knee and as y'all know right here I will post the prices but yes I love this dress it is a cream it's not white it's like a cream or a winter white, as most people would say. But yes, I love this. Classic, again, sweater dress, something that y'all will see me in all fall and winter. So let's go ahead and move on to the skirt and the top that I got to go with it. Okay, so I'm not really sure who this sweater was made for. Let me get a little bit closer because you can see right here, turn this down. Right here, you can see my bra. I'm not really sure. And then also, if I back up these sleeves, I'm, I'm not really sure what's going on with these sleeves because I feel like this should be up here. So it seems like this should be up here, but then if you do that, it has like this little weird foldy type thing, okay? So let's just put it back down here. But then also the sleeves, they're just really big. This is an extra small, so like I said, I'm not sure who they made this for. So this will probably be going back, but the skirt, I love the skirt. Y'all know from one of my previous videos, one of my favorite things to wear, especially during fall and winter, is a pencil skirt. But not just a pencil skirt, but a sweater pencil skirt. So let me back up so you can see. midi length and when I tell you that this band of course you know again who doesn't want to be snatched you know snatches you up in all the right places but the material is so soft and so comfortable and it seems like that this dress or I'm sorry that this skirt would be really warm but it is absolutely beautiful I love the color and it's showing up like a gray color but it's more so kind of like an I would say maybe like a dark oatmeal because it does have tones of gray in it but it also has tones of tan in it and that's the reason why why I bought the top because it goes with the bottom y'all know my three wear rule make sure that whenever you are buying something make sure that when you buy it or before you even check out before you are trying on in the store and you go to the register or before you're shopping online and you press that buy button make sure that it fits with at least three other things in your closet make sure that you can make at least three outfits with it if you can't chances are it's going to sit in your closet and we don't want that to happen because there's very precious space in our closets but yeah I love the look of it, but I'm just not sure of the top. The top is more than likely gonna have to go back because I'm not sure what, what's going on. So let me take it out because it is rather long, but even still, um, it's just, it's a really weird fit. So I guess some, some people would consider this a tunic. This is not how I would wear it, but even still, just in raising my arms, um, the lace right here just feels a little constricted because when you raise your arm, it kind of cuts into it. But yeah, this would be going back, okay? Now, let's go ahead and move on to Aritzio, one of my favorite places to shop, and I will link up here other places where I do shop. So let's get into those. 
Okay, so now let's move on to Aritzia. And if you would have seen my places to shop video, you would have seen that I love Aritzia. So these last four pieces will be from Aritzia. And also, if you did see that video, you would have seen this turtleneck in two other colors, in a gray and a camel. I love this top so much that I chose to get it in two other colors. So this is the first one, it is the cream. It came back in stock. Now this one, I believe I got an extra, extra small in. So let me back up so you can see. And this is this um, skirt from Express. So this is cropped, which that was the whole purpose. I did love it. I mean, it does have a little bit of a dolman sleeve and then it just comes and it tapers down. It has the turtleneck effect. And then this is the back. And I will say that it doesn't quite feel the same. It's a little less scratchier and it's a little, the material has definitely changed. Now this is Italian blend wool. Um, it's not as heavy as the first two that I bought, but that's fine because I do foresee it foresee it being just as warm. And actually it goes really well with what I have on. Of course my tried and true clip that y'all know. And then this um, skirt, I think it goes really well with this. This, out this could be an outfit within itself. And then I think that we could probably go with these or these will look really pretty. I haven't had a chance to wear these and these are off white as well. Probably look really good with these, and these are from J. Crew. Okay. So now I will just show you really quickly the other color that I bought. Okay, so what other color would it be besides black? It is the exact same sweater from the first one that I showed you. Now, this one is an extra small. The one that I just showed you is an extra extra. And to be honest, I really don't see a difference. Again, it is cropped and then you just have the tie right here. The only difference that I see is a little bit bigger in the neck area. So what I would do is I would probably, from the back right here, take a brooch and I would just pin it right there. And that would also give it a little bit of flair. So I actually, and I just came up with that. I think I really like that idea. But now let me also show you this skirt that I have on. And again, and if you would have seen the um, places that I shot video, you would have seen this skirt. It is from Aritzia, but the company is called Babyton, and I absolutely love their clothing. This skirt is 100% wool. And again, this one does feel a little bit different. It feels a little bit lighter, but let me go ahead and back up and just show you. The skirt is midi length and it also has a slit in the back. The slit is not all the way up so it, there's nothing showing, but I absolutely love this look. Sometimes monochrome looks and very simple structured um, outfits can actually be just as beautiful as an over the top dress or an over the top ensemble. But yes, I absolutely love this. And I love wearing black. So that's why I got it in black, but also because here we are again with classic and colors. Turtlenecks are classic and black is classic. So let's go ahead and move on to the last thing I bought, which is I had to replace one of these skirts because the other skirt, it is camel, it's just like this one. It was an extra, extra small. It's a little tight, so I decided to get a small. So let me show you guys that one as well. Okay, so this skirt was 148, just like the black one. Like I said before, it is 100% wool, so I don't mind paying for quality, but it has to truly be quality. Now, it does have a band, and I love that because it keeps it up. It is high-waisted, but it also, again, cinches in the waist and it goes all the way around. And then let's take some shoes real quick. I love these shoes, they're from Zara, and I think they go beautifully with this outfit. And this is something that I typically would just wear really sitting at my desk, running errands, going out. It's a, it's a beautiful casual outfit. Okay, so while I still love the way that these two pieces fit, I have noticed, and like I said before, that the not the quality, but the material has changed a little bit. So both for the turtleneck and for the skirt, the material is a little bit thinner. Um, you know, as far as retail is concerned, you know, they're always 
changing things but still having the same price. This top was 128 and then the bottom is 148 and it would follow suit for the other two that I just showed you guys. Um, I'm not, it's not that I'm disappointed, it's just that I really notice a difference. Um, so I would be interested to, to see how this sweater actually wears in cooler weather because the other two that I showed again in the last video, they were thicker and they were a lot like more fuzzier. So I'm just kind of curious to see how this will hold up in cool weather, like whether or not I will have to actually wear a jacket or put something under it. Because the other two, I mean, in anything less, anything higher than 60 or 65, you would be dying in those other ones. So I'm just kind of curious to see how how this would fare in weather and maybe i'll do a comparison in, in a different video when i wear this outside um like i said I'm, I'm not disappointed but i'm just curious because i i noticed it you know sometimes you don't notice things but i definitely noticed that both pieces are actually a lot thinner than the first ones that i purchased even though that was a couple of years ago um but that's neither here nor there that's all that I have for you guys today. I just want to thank you so much for hanging out with me. I also want to remind you that here on Instagram, here on YouTube, I upload videos every Wednesday and Sunday. And then of course, you know, right here, I will put my Instagram handle. Thank you so much for watching. Bye y'all.